Mike Pring, SID at Adrian College here with head men's hockey coach Adam Krug along with senior defenseman Jaden Shields after a 2-1 to one loss in the semifinal game of the NCAA tournament to Trinity. Coach, let's start with an opening statement. Game went uh, went the way that I thought it would if we lost. We just couldn't get to uh, Devin. He was, uh, he was very good. Um, made some timely saves. We didn't necessarily get the great A's that, uh, that I think we needed. Um, he made some big saves, a couple of um, interesting bounces, especially in the third period. A couple went through him. We, we didn't get any bounces in that sense, but uh, ultimately, um, you know, we just uh, their their team defense was was very good, and um, we just needed another great A or two. It seemed like there was a lot of just pucks that bounced the wrong way for us. There was the one that was in the crease that just. It's kind of a mess in front of the net that we couldn't find the back of it. Talk about, you know, the play of the game there. I don't know what I can say about it. I just, it was pucks bouncing. Sometimes you get the bounces, sometimes you don't. Um, I'm, I'm a big believer that you create your own bounces. We played hard. I don't know why we didn't get bounces tonight. Um, but, again, Trinity did a great job. They're well coached. You can see their structure and the way they play. Um, very deserving of being here. And... Uh, you know, congratulations to them, of course. Jaden, you've been on this team for four years now, and you've played in three Frozen Fours. Did you think that would happen during your career? Uh, no. No, to be honest with you. Um, but I knew that Adrian was, you know, the home for me, and I was just grateful to have the opportunity to put on this jersey. And uh, the fact that it came along with, with three Frozen Fours is, you know, something that a lot of guys can't say in the country. And... Uh, it's definitely something I'll remember for the rest of my life. I know the team kind of circles around the word brotherhood throughout the program. That's kind of been the, the vibe of the team, the culture of the team. You know, talk about those guys that help, helped you get to these Frozen Fours and especially this team that you played with tonight. Yeah, um, that locker room's a special place, you know. Um, it's, I don't have very many words except it's, it's something that I'm going to remember for the rest of my life, um, you know. I don't know that I'll go anywhere else, work a job ever in my life, uh, go on to play pro, that, that is going to have that same connection in the locker room that um, we have here at Adrian. And, yeah, I don't know. I don't have very many words right now. Hey, Coach. All right. Uh, great season. Uh, obviously not the way you wanted it to end. Um, you know, they got the first one, and then uh, you guys come down and hit a pipe, and they go down the other way and score, and all of a sudden it's 2 nothing. Um, tough team to play from behind with. What, uh, you know, what what did they do defensively that really frustrated you guys, not giving you the great A's you were looking for? They packed it in. They, um, they don't get spread out. Um, they play as a unit. You know, a lot of te a lot of teams get loose. Uh, they were committed to, to not letting that happen. Um, I didn't even think about the post. No, not that you bring that up. Um, <laughs> well, there were three or four. Yeah. Um, yeah, it, it can be a frustrating game sometimes. Jaden, um, when I talked to Coach uh, before the Frozen Four, he was talking about you know um, your run to the to the, the gauntlet you went through to even get here. I mean, you got to beat a Stevens Point team that's like eighth in the country, and then Norbert, who's fifth, and now you got Trinity, who's, I don't know, second, third, somewhere in there, and you would have had to play Hobart. Um, it's like the standard for your program now. You, it's almost like the expectation of your former players and teammates is, you know, this is what Adrian Hockey's about, getting to the Frozen Four. How does it feel to be part of the foundation that's created that? Yeah, uh, it's it's unbelievable. Um, you know, it it's the standard, like you said. Um, you know, the the standard within the locker room is uh, not only win games but win championships. And um, you know, yeah, it, it was going to be a gauntlet to win it. But if there was a group of guys that could have done it, it was definitely that group of guys that that you saw on the ice tonight. And um, you know, it's. It's a it's a pleasure. It's a pleasure to play with the guys in the room and, and play for a coach like uh, Coach Kruger here. And you know, it's the I couldn't have dreamt of of you know playing in three frozen fours and um, you know just going through that gauntlet was 
we were, I, I felt that this group was ready for the task and, um, you know, we gave it our all out there for sure. Coach, do you think at times going into the game that, you know, whether how much you, you may have said it, do you think your players, you know, maybe say the younger one possibly might have overlooked Trinity considering who you've played? No chance. No. Um, they've got a banner hanging at center ice. <clears throat> they won a national title. Um, same coach. It's a good program. Um, you see the numbers. They've got the national player of the year in their goal crease. We didn't overlook them, our, our young guys included. And Coach, I would, I would say, what's it mean for you to, be, to hear those words from your, your senior in regard to that, you know, brotherhood in the locker room that you've created and now the standard here is essentially, you know, you're always going to win 20 games, you're always going to, you know, the standard is the pros are four now. And so what's it mean for you to hear those words coming from Well, I appreciate it. I mean, the, these guys, um, they created it. Uh, we give them that avenue to create it. It's up to them. And they do it. Um, you know, I don't know if I could have said it much better than Jaden did. Um, they're this team for whatever reason just was so close, and I, you know, we've been through a lot with them, and, and so much of it is good. Um, but they're strong. They're really strong, and they they know that they're capable of just about anything. So. Um, you know, I appreciate that they they were willing to come here to Adrian College, uh, do what they've done that class specifically. Um, they'll, they'll go down in history at Adrian College is the most decorated class, I, I believe, um, and they should. They've been a huge piece. I mean, Jane's freshman year it was in an NCAA tournament. Um, you know, we were really young, we're really talented. Uh, we got knocked out of the playoffs um, by MSOE. <laughs> <laughs> but that team learned so much. They did. They learned so much. Um, I really think that loss propelled us to the next three years. Um, but credit to these guys because they, they came to the rink every day to get better. And uh, that is the standard in our, in our room, is to come to the rink with a purpose every day, get better, get stronger in the weight room. And then when you leave the rink, the standard is to be the best people you can be. And these guys are doing that. Uh, we've got a ton of really good students. Um, I, I'm not chasing guys around campus, making sure they're in class, making sure they're, they're going to be eligible. They take care of their business. They're men. And uh, I appreciate these guys a ton. I've got one more, uh, Jaden. What's the, you know, being a senior, what's the main, the one thing that you would like to be remembered for by your coaches, your teammates around you, and all this, everybody that you've experienced time with at Adrian in your career? What's the one thing you'd like them to remember you for? Yeah, um, that's a really good question. Um, you know, just a guy that comes to the rink and, and works as hard as he can every single day. Um, Try my best to be a good teammate, uh, you know, a, a good leader to the younger guys. Um, I try to carry myself with, um, you know, a, a certain standard towards my professors, um, the the student body, um, President Docking. You know, I I would like to be remembered as, you know, overall just a, a good person that, you know came here and did everything he could for this program to, um, you know, leave it better than I found it. And he did. Coach, one more question about the game. You get a penalty called on them and three minutes left in the game, you're down a goal, power play. Did you think about pulling Dershawn at the time? We did. Going six on four? What, uh, what tilted it towards not doing it? Was it just too early to to do that at that time or that power play scored big goals all year yeah i know exactly yeah yeah and you pull the goalie they get they get the ability to have free icing um i don't know if i could do it again maybe but i, I think that's one of those that just you trust those guys they've done it um it didn't happen tonight but did they do anything different on the power play to take any way uh, you know specific options you know i know Heinz one timer is always a, a big play for you guys. Yeah. Didn't really seem to get that look. 
yeah. tonight in the power plays you had. Yeah, they, they sat on that, um, but we have a little wrinkle that, that we can adjust with, and Matt Redding made a, a really good decision in the second period uh, down at this end um, just to make that read and sprint down the wall, and Jake Swade popped, and he was wide open. Uh, we had a really good look at it, but Jake Jake was on the ice um, on our first power play when, when we drew the penalty, so he was a little tired, and uh, I just think he was probably not as sharp right in that moment. Um, you know, and then the, the play was kind of there again. Um, we just didn't execute it. Um, you know, and at that point, it's just down to, to hard work and heart for Trinity. So they're you know doing everything they can to disrupt plays, and they did that. Uh, Jaden, obviously we know about um, your career and the, the older gentleman on this team. Uh, but you're paired up with a freshman defender with, with Julian. Um, I saw young people step up tonight and make plays. Could you talk about uh, their performance too? Yeah. Um, you know, it, it, it took every guy in the room um, from seniors to, fre to, to freshmen. Um, you know, they've, they've been a big piece for us. Uh, you know, we, we graduated a lot of really talented guys last year. And, um, you know, that's credit to the staff for, you know, not only bringing in um, you know really good hockey players but good people those guys bought in from from day one and uh, you know like we talked about it it's the standard um, it's the standard to win and and they they realized that on on day one um, you know it was it was great to play with them um, yeah that's, that's about all I have. Um, coach we all know the support of this program Adrian's on a short drive from here for a short flight. They showed up to support despite the overwhelming home fan advantage. Could you could you speak to that? Sure. Yeah, they did. You could hear them. You know, um, the guys went on the ice um, for starting lineups. They were they were there, and uh, it's pretty special what we have back home. And I know there's a lot more that uh, wish they could be here and couldn't be for. A lot of different reasons, but uh, through the last three Frozen Fours, um, I, it's kind of amazing how many people this really matters to. Um, so, thank you to them. Um, they're, they're, this program is special, and uh, you know, when you have a community that rallies around your guys the way they do, um, it, it makes you feel like you're just really part of something really big. So we're a small school, um, but we're a big hockey program. That's it. Thank you. Congrats, guys, on a, another successful season, third consecutive Frozen Four, and finishing the year 24-7-1. and one. So congrats on a good year, guys, and safe travels home. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Good to see you.